Don't you love game to me? Partridge in a pear tree. <laughs> On the first day of Christmas, my true love gave to me a partridge in a pear tree. What's up, guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Clearly not a singer. Where's my little ball? Oh, found it. So in today's YouTube video, I will be talking about my workout splits. So what day I do my upper body, my lower body, cardio workout, and I will also be showing you what is in my gym bag. So sit tight, hold on to your coffee mugs, your BCAs, whatever it is. I think this has a lot of caffeine in it. Oh, so sweet. And let's get into this video. Oh, but first, wait, wait, don't go anywhere. There's a giveaway at the end of the video, so stick around to the end of the video and don't skip to the end. I know you guys that skip to the end. Also, if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. So my gym routine, I'm gonna let you guys in a secret. I don't work out. Oh no, she did. Oh yes, she did. I'm just kidding. <laughs> my workout routine is two upper body days and two lower body days and two hit cardio days so usually six days a week um if i do do five days a week i will eliminate a cardio day and just do one hit cardio day um i don't do too much cardio on the other days sometimes i do when i'm cutting for do I really cut though? When I'm looking to lose a little bit of body fat, but right now I am comfortable where I'm at and that's why I'm only doing cardio once, maybe twice per week. So my upper body days are usually on Tuesday, Thursdays and I'll either do them at F45 gym, which I also work at and it's amazing. If you guys have one in the area, make sure you check it out or I will do it at the gym. Um, I, I like to do my upper body days either a pull or a push so that means for a pull day it's gonna be biceps and back <laughs> and for a push day it's shoulders and triceps sometimes I'll switch it up and I'll do like biceps and triceps to do like a complete arm workout but lately it's been the pull push split and then for my leg days I'm not gonna lie to you guys I mostly focus on the booty and the hamstrings so I don't work quads as much. I'll do a hamstring and glute focus day and then my other leg day will be an overall leg focus. That's how I structure my workouts. My workouts are usually an hour to an hour and a half. Just leg days are usually about an hour and a half. Upper body days are usually just an hour. There's really no need to go more than that. And my hit cardio days that I do at F45 are 45 minutes long. So like it says, functional being lots of high intensity hit cardio. Let's move on to what's in my gym bag. All right, so first things first, we have my headphones. Can you guys see the bottom of the gym? Oh, I don't think you can. Here's my gym bag. Nice, heavy duty Lululemon gym bag. I really, really love this gym bag. I've had it forever, basically. Um, so I have these soundproof headphones from Beats. Definitely recommend, if you do not have a pair of headphones, getting a pair of earbuds or headphones. No need to go out and grab Beats. I couldn't imagine working out. In fact, I will not work out without my headphones. So if I forget my headphones at home, I will drive back home and get my headphones. That way I don't hear anyone. Did you hear that? Because I did it. Next we have my hip circle. I have two of these, um, the small and the medium slash large. This is the medium large. I love, 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 love these. I will take them on vacation with me anywhere I go. They're amazing bands because they have this rubber on the inside. That way it doesn't twist and turn on your thighs like a lot of bands do. I get a really great booty pump with these. These are a great booty accessory piece of equipment. I don't know, I feel like everyone could use these, especially if you do workouts at home. These are great home workout bands. And enough about the bands. Next, we have more bands actually, but these are different kind of bands. These are some long bands that I also do a lot of leg work with and some pull-ups. <laughs> things are flying everywhere. 
So I have this one is the 40 pound resistance and this one is I I think it was like 16 pounds I want to say. Anyways, I have these two different bands. Um, with this one, I'll do a lot of pull-ups, also do some hip thrusters with it. And then this one, I'll throw it on when I'm doing deadlifts or good mornings or squats just for added resistance, a little bit extra challenge. So I love these bands as well. You can't go wrong with bands, guys. It's great to pack on vacation because it doesn't weigh that much. All right, next I have is my standard jump rope that I always carry with me everywhere I go. When I'm traveling, again, super light, easy, nice cardio. I don't use this one that much anymore because we have them at the gym, so I'll use the ones over there. But this is my own personal jump rope in case I go outdoors and do my workout. This next one, you must have tampons in your gym bag because you just never know girlfriend you just never know so I always carry this with me oh okay if you're gonna have anything in your gym bag besides a pair of headphones these are my absolute favorite piece of accessory <laughs> that I have in my gym bag they are my wrist wraps they so help me keep my wrists in place and especially because I have some weaknesses in my right wrist. So this really helps keep it nice and steady and it just goes like that. It's not a medical wrist wrap or a wrist brace. It's just for lifting. So if you're lifting in the gym and you want some support on your wrists, this is your guy. Okay. Next we have, I'm not going to open this, but I have a bunch more bands in here. These are the like more flimsy ones that will shift and turn. Um, also great to have. <sighs> Next we have is my weightlifting belt. I have a pink one. I kind of want to get the leather version. This one is, what's the material? Half of it is just straight foam. I use it mostly when I'm doing some heavy deadlift or squats. I don't like to use it on everything. I know people rely on their weightlifting belt for literally every single exercise. I think you need to engage your core more and build up your low back strength. And if you have this guy on, you're not going to be doing that. I see some people using it all the time. Okay. Next, we have our my straps. So now these are straps that wrap around an actual piece of equipment just like this and then I'm gonna wrap this around and grab onto the bar and what this does essentially is it helps if you have maybe some weak forearms or you don't train your forearms which a lot of people don't then this is gonna help you with your grip so it's gonna help you focus less on gripping the piece of equipment and more on engaging the muscle that you're trying to work so I actually do love these as well when I'm lifting heavy because sometimes my, say my back can lift heavier than my grip can lift, if that makes sense. So there's, you use two of these, just not on one, the other ones. Somewhere around here, but anyways, I love these guys. This is it. So lastly, I have this towel in here, which I always use a towel because I am a germaphobe. No, I'm not a germaphobe. You disgust me, how can you live with yourself? Some people might argue I'm a germaphobe, but I just really like to keep things clean. Keep it clean, wipe it down. I just like to keep the space and treat it as if I would want to be treated. So I want to come to a nice, clean piece of equipment, not a sweaty one. But anyway, that's that, guys. All right, guys, you made it to the end of the video. So thank you so much for watching. Today's giveaway is a Starbucks gift card. I love Starbucks. I don't go as often because I'm cheap and <laughs> I prefer to make coffee at home, but it is my coffee house of choice when I do go get coffee. So if you would like to win this Starbucks gift card, please tell me two things you are grateful for in the comment section down below. Just two things I want to hear what you guys are grateful for this holiday season. Also make sure you read the description box below in order to be eligible to win. There's a few things that I want you guys to do, so make sure you check the description box out. All right, I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.